Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Kubuntu 24.04.2 LDS version on VirtualBox. First download the Kubuntu ISO image. So go to Kubuntu official website that is kubuntu.com. Then so click on download. Then see here we have the versions 25.04, 24.10 and see here the LDS version 24.04.2. So click on this 64 bit download. It is the long term support list. See download started. Go to download. See here its size is 4.2 gigabytes. I am cancelling this one because I have already downloaded. See here. I have already downloaded Kubuntu 24.04 desktop ISO image. In your case, wait until download completes. Once download is completed, then open virtual box. If you want to install virtual box on your machine, then search for my YouTube channel how to install virtual box on Windows or Linux operating systems. Okay. Then click on new or go to machine and select new both are same click on new then provide the name for the virtual machine then select the path to store this virtual machine files and folders and this is the default location if you want some other location click on drop down and select other then select the path where you have the enough space Then select the downloaded ISO image, select other, then select the Kubuntu 24.04.2 ISO image. Click on open. See, once we selected ISO image, see type change it to Linux, subtype to Ubuntu version 64 bit. And see here the skip unattended installation. So select the checkbox, then come to hardware. See by default memory selected as 2 gigabytes. So I am giving for number of CPU equals to then hard disk I am giving 50 gigabytes then click on finish still if you want to modify the settings of this virtual machine right click and select settings or just select from this list and click on settings or go to machine and select settings all three options are same ok we are okay with all the settings then click on start Now use up and down arrows and select the first one that is try or install Kubuntu and hit enter. Now select the language and internet connection. See it is connected. Select the language from this list. Okay. Then see here we have the two options try Kubuntu or install Kubuntu. Try Kubuntu is the temporary one and install Kubuntu is the permanent. In this video we are going to install it. So click on this install Kubuntu. Now select the language and click on next. Now select your region from this globe or you can select from this list. Then you have to select the zone. Okay, I am okay with the default. Suppose if you are from US, you have to click on here. Okay, so click on next and select keyboard model and language information. I am going with all defaults. Click on next and see here we have the installation modes three types full, normal, and minimal. Okay, full means all applications in normal installation and extra third party applications listed below see these are the third party application you select this one see those are automatically selected if you minimal see those options gone but if you select normal these are optionally you can select either select it or unselect it it is up to you so i don't want either of them so go click on normal installation and click on next see this is a fresh installation so select this erase disk and click on next now we have to create our setup user so i'm giving user full name as r schools and this will be the username then this will be the computer name or host name i'm giving then provide the password for this user and from the same then click on next see ready to install this is the war you are summary if you're okay with all the settings it's okay otherwise click on back and you can edit if you are ok with all the settings then click on install again this is asking confirmation click on install now see installation has been started this will take time i am going to pause this video 
and at then it will ask us to reboot the system then we will reboot the system and we will perform the post installation steps in meantime please subscribe my channel for more tutorials see here kubuntu has been installed on your system you may now restart into your new system or continue using live environment so i want to use the new system so select the check box that is restart now and click on done so click on done Now we have to provide the password of this user. See, welcome to KDE Plasma. Click on next step. Next. I don't want either of them. So none of them. Okay. See, we got the Kubuntu. Now open terminal. Go to applications. See here we have the console. Click on it. Now increase the part. Go to view. And see here we have the. We have to press control plus to control plus plus to increase the part. See part is increased. Okay. Just we have to select control and press plus. Okay. Now we pay the version that we have to start more slash etc. OS hyphen release. See, we got the Ubuntu 24. Okay, and its code name is Novel. Control L. Now we are not getting the full screen. So go to Devices, then click on Insert Guest Edition CD Image. See, we got the here. So click on this Mount and Open. Now right click on any one of them. Or just right click Terminal here. Ls. Control plus plus to increase the font. Now we have to install this one. Sudo vbox editions. Copy this one. Dot forward slash. Paste it. Hit enter. Write the password of sudo user. Hit enter. See now it is installing guest editions. See, we have successfully installed. Double click on this one and click on maximize. See, we got the full screen. Okay. Now, the first step after connecting to Kubuntu is we have to update the packages. sudo apt update percent percent sudo apt upgrade. Hit enter. Then, provide the password of sudo user. Hit enter. Type A for confirmation and hit enter. Okay. Now it is upgrading packages. So this will take time. So in this video we have seen how to install Kubuntu 24.04.2 LDS version on virtual box. Okay. For more tutorials, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.